Hello again from Alation Productions. Uh, today I got something a little bit different to show you. I've, in order to continue working on my CNC project, I discovered it would be very helpful to get my tapping head back in running condition. I bought this thing several years ago, and the only problem really with it was I had no collets to hold the taps and I need to fix the set screw for the um, stop there on it. But I've got back in working condition again and I can show you just how it works. It's going to speed things up. I have um, a heat sink basically which I'm going to mount the controllers on, four different controllers and that takes 16 different holes which need to be tapped out in order to mount these controllers to this heat sink I'm building. And to save time and to keep the holes nice and straight I decided to get my Procunior uh, quarter inch uh, actually this is a here I'll show you the stats on it right here. You can see this is a size number one of a style E Procunior tapping uh, attachment. And all this basically is is just a two-way clutch. When you push down on it, it engages the forward clutch which will turn the same direction that the shaft of the drill press is turning. Now, let me see if I can show you here. When I pull down on this you see there's some play. You push up it pushes into a clutch. Then there's a point where it free spins and if you pull down far enough it engages a reversing clutch which will back the tap back out of the piece. I'll show you exactly how it works right now with this other side of this piece here.
and that's basically all there is to it. As you can see, it sped up all eight of those holes very quick and easy, and it kept them nice and straight too because we're attached to a nice straight shaft on our drill press here. Uh, as you saw during the operation, though, about three, oh, well, about five holes in it was. As you can see, our collet came out. Now, this is not the original collet that came with this. This is kind of a quick fix which I made up. All this basically is, is a hole big enough to fit a number six tap into. And as you can see I've got, well originally I had one. After it came out I stuck a second set screw into my little uh, makeshift collet here. And it seems to be holding up a little bit better. We'll see long term if it will hold it in there. Uh, without coming out again. But that's basically there is to it, the little makeshift collar I had there to get it up and running. And I've got all 16 of my holes all tapped out and ready to go now in very quick succession. I hope you enjoyed watching today. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them below. And until next time.